This is Charlene with Real TV Films talking to Rick Jacobson at the premiere of Bitch Slap. He is the writer, producer, director. Uh, I got my ass handed to me um, filming this movie because I, I operated a lot of it. And um, it, uh, it bitch slapped the snot out of me. So yeah, so that's where I got bitch slapped the most. In what respect would you say? In, in what Just the, the, the sheer physical holding the camera on my shoulder because all of the desert stuff was... We, you know, 90% of the film was, 95% of the film was shot on one camera, and that camera was parked on my shoulder. So just being in the elements, the awkward positions, uh, it, was, it was brutal. But, you know, I, I did that, I, I put that, that cross on my own back um, just because I'm very particular about composition and framing, and, um, you know, most big films will have three or four cameras shooting all at once, and... I didn't want to do it that way on this one because I wanted to have my eye on every camera. So, like I said, I, I carried that cross myself. Who would you say were your film influences besides the 60s and 70s exploitation? What films? What films were? In? Well, filmmakers. Or what, I see a little Russ Mayer influence. Is, well, am I correct? Yeah, of course. Um, he's a big influence, obviously. Kind of in, you know, we, we certainly drawed upon the, the exploitation films, the, the themes and situations. But, you know, interestingly enough, it, it, didn't, it didn't really kind of start out, uh, you know, Eric and I did not sit down and say, let's make a new exploitation film. It, we kind of backed into it. I, I had started writing this treatment, and, uh, and then I joined up with Eric, and we were just simply writing a, a film that we both wanted to see and we thought would be fun, and more than anything else, we wanted it to be an easy sell because, you know, obviously just selling films in this town is very difficult. So we just wanted something that was an easy sell, and you know what's a, what's more than easy sell than beautiful. I mean, you look at this poster, that's an easy sell. So um, it was just kind of that. But you know, yeah, the Russ Meyer films big. I'm I grew up making films, so you know I've always been heavily influenced by the Hitchcocks, the Ridley Scotts, the James Camerons, the Spielbergs, the Lucas. You know, I'm the Star Wars generation, so. Um, those, those films certainly influenced me. And, you know, you, if you watch this film and you watch it enough times, you'll see plenty of Star Wars references and, and Jaws references and Alien. You know, there's, there's, it's a film lover's movie. Um, and there's a lot of kind of just little fun hidden things throughout the film that hopefully on like, if you watch it like three, four, five times, you're like, every time you'll go like, oh my God, look at that. It's the idol from Raiders of the Lost Ark, and it's in there. We're at the premiere for Bitch Slap with Rick Jacobson, writer, producer, director. Thank you for watching Real TV Films.